Walker, thank you for watching Erie News Now at 6 o'clock. Each year, the National Fallen Firefighters Foundation sponsors a tribute to all firefighters who died in the line of duty during the previous year. At this tribute today in Emmitsburg, Maryland, Northeast firefighter Sean Giles from Fuller Host Company was among those remembered. Our Kara Jeffers was there and has the story for us. We're not honoring these firefighters because of the way they died. We're honoring them because of the way they lived. The National Fallen Firefighter Foundation hosted its 43rd annual memorial service this morning in Emmitsburg, Maryland. It's been an experience that I will carry with me for the rest of my life. 89 firefighters died in the line of duty in 2023, including Northeast local Sean Giles. The weekend was exhausting. It was nice to be around other people who truly know what you're going through, um, that really feel that day to day. You know what I mean? The loss. Giles was killed last August when a car crashed into him while he was giving traffic support. I think we all come to the firehouse every day trying to fill his shoes. Um, he was a very large individual uh, and, and he did a lot for the department. Families and fellow firefighters are hosted in Emmitsburg for a memorial weekend each year. For me, the most touching was receiving the flag. When they give you the flag and then they give you the badge and it's got his name on it. Across the nation, communities are encouraged to also honor and remember lives lost. I really was trying to encourage the Light It Up Red. So we did a fantastic job, which I obviously couldn't have done without the community. They really rallied behind me. So next year I hope to make it bigger and better. So look out Northeast and surrounding areas, because here I come, you know, bring it to awareness and let people do realize, you know, make them realize that, you know, somebody did lose their life. And, you know, let's not forget. We don't want to forget them. And this year, there were an additional 137 firefighters remembered from previous years. The foundation is now recognizing cancer and other fatal illnesses as correlated to a firefighter's life of service and going back to give full honor to all. Again, that was our Kara Jeffers reporting.